sad day today, ladies and gentlemen. It is the end of the Baker Board's life. I mean, not really. I mean, I guess this has like a little bit of life left in it, but if you guys saw my last video, I cracked this board. This honestly was the best board that I ever had. Like I said, when I made the setup video for this board, I had never had a Baker board before. Um, this was my very first one and I loved it. I fell in love with it, but I ended up cracking it. So it's time for a new board, which is this Death Wish board. Like I said, I asked you guys what board you guys wanted me to set up next. A lot of you guys said Creature and Death Wish, and I was gonna go with Creature, but I had a Creature board already. Like I used to skate Creature all the time, but I've never had a Death Wish board. So I wanna give this one a try. Honestly, I might, I might just keep this board as like a backup because it didn't crack on the bottom or anything right here. It cracked on the top and it's really hard to see on camera for some reason, but it cracked from like this bolt to this bolt and then like from that bolt to this bolt. So like every time I put weight on the tail, like when I bend down to do a trick, it just, it, it, it flexes and it just feels really weak. So I'm gonna keep this one as like a backup. And you guys know, you guys know how much I loved this board right here. I mean, just look at those two beauties right there. Out with the old and with the new though. Also, this is gonna be the first board setup that I do with the GoPro. A lot, all, Almost all of you guys were like, make a setup video with the GoPro, like a first person setup of the board. So I'm gonna do that. I was gonna get new trucks too, but I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna skate these until I can anymore and then I'll get new trucks. So hopefully in the next board setup, I'll have new trucks too. And you guys know how much I hate taking off and putting on the trucks. So I found this, uh, electric screwdriver in my house so I'm gonna use that and hopefully it doesn't die on me because I didn't charge it or anything I just picked it up and brought it but anyway we got a death wish board size 825 hopefully I love this board as much as I love that one because that one was just perfect the size was perfect the shape was perfect the pop lasted a really long time it was super durable hopefully this one comes close to that like I said never had a death wish board before so um hopefully I like it man hopefully I like it but anyway on Instagram I asked you guys to leave me questions so I can answer them while I set this board up and I got so many questions obviously I can't answer every single question um, but I'm gonna answer a good a good a good amount of them so just like the last setup video I'm gonna set up the board answer some questions and um, yeah this one's gonna be different though because it's gonna be with the GoPro which I'm gonna put on right now okay so we got the death wish board size 825 we got you guys know I gotta have the mob grip you know what I'm saying always mob grip always the mob grip bones wheels you guys know I love bones wheels I don't skate anything else got the bones wheels bones bearings independent trucks like I said I was gonna get new trucks but I didn't so hopefully in the next one I have new trucks but I'm just gonna get right into this man because I like I said I have a lot of questions to answer and setting up a board takes a while so yeah I'm just gonna start answering questions because I have so many um where do you see yourself in a year in a year I see myself wait hold on do I have a razor blade please tell me I have a razor blade in here yes I do okay in a year I see myself with over a hundred thousand subscribers hopefully my own place hopefully I have the Tesla by then I don't know a year can go oh a trash can sick a year can go by so fast though so dude i don't know but yeah hopefully i have a hundred thousand i mean i'm pretty sure i'm gonna have over a hundred thousand subscribers by then um and hopefully i have the tesla by then too honestly i want the tesla more than my own place dude this board is so sick i'm so excited to skate this the shape shape looks pretty good too concave looks really good what is the best skate park you have ever been to the best skate park I have ever been to is Craig Ranch Park here in Las Vegas. That is the best park that I have ever, like, ever been to. It's amazing. It's massive. It has everything there. It has street, tranny, manual pads, rails. It has it has everything you could you could want to skate. Dude, I hate putting on the grip tape because I always feel like always feel like I'm gonna get air bubbles, man. We good. We chilling, chilling. Chilling, chilling. Oh, I kind of fucked up a little. Dude, every time I put on grip tape, I fuck up a little bit. Oh, but we chilling, chilling. Who's your favorite skater? Also put me in the video. There you go, you're in the video. But my favorite skater, as a lot of you know, is Shane O'Neal. Oh, I don't have my actual screwdriver to like. I guess I'll use this. Favorite skater, Shane O'Neal. And I'm wearing his shoes right now, the Shane's, which are my favorite skate shoes right now. Like, it still blows my mind how well these shoes are holding up. Dude, I'm so, like, I still want to be skating this board so bad. Dude, I'm so mad that one broke. You ever surf? No, and I probably never will. My biggest fear is drowning. Like, I cannot picture anything scarier than drowning. I, like, nothing to me is scarier than drowning. I can't even think about drowning or else I'll get, like, goosebumps, dude. So, yeah, I'm probably never going to surf ever. You like horror. I've noticed the Ouija board and Chucky stuff in the videos. Yes, dude, I'm the biggest fan of horror. Like, anything horror, I love it. Dude, my ex-girlfriend and, like, just random people, too, literally think that I, like, worship the devil or something because I'm, like, such a fan of, like, everything creepy and scary. Like, anything satanic and demonic and just, like, anything like that, dude, I love it. It's just, it's just so sick, dude. That's why I like creature boards so much, because their graphics are just, like, so sick. Even the shirt I'm wearing right now, I'll show you guys later, but, like, literally the shirt that I'm wearing right now has the creepiest thing on the back of it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. 
perfect, perfect, perfect. Oh, this right here could have been a little better. There we go. Oh, kind of fucked it up, whatever. What did you like about your old deck? Dude, the shape, the durability, how long the tail lasted me. Literally just everything about it, even like the paint that they used on here. Like this metallic, or actually I don't even think this is paint. A lot of you guys were saying like it's some type of foil. Even that is so sick, like I don't know, I just love this board so much. Like I said, this literally was the best board that I've ever skated. I'm really surprised you didn't buy a creature deck. Yeah, I know, I love creature boards so much, but you guys really wanted me to get a Death Wish. Like I said, I never had it before, so I definitely want to try this one out. What time of day do you skate? Um, usually I'll try to skate early in the morning when it's not super hot or late in the day at like six, seven o'clock. Now I gotta like guess where the holes are. Um, honestly, honestly, I just try to avoid the heat. So either in the morning or close to nighttime. Dude, I'm literally guessing where the holes are right now. Got it. Yeah. How often do you change your deck? Honestly, I try to keep boards for as long as I can. This one I had for... How long do I have this? I know it's been over a month. I'm not exactly sure how long I had this board, but um, I try to I try to keep boards and trucks and wheels and everything for as long, as, even shoes. Like I, I try to keep everything for as long as I can. I just don't like spending money on things that I don't actually need, you know? Like I'm not gonna go buy a new board just because like my tail gets a little worn down, you know? So yeah, I'll try to keep everything for like as long as possible. I'll keep a board like over a month easily, unless I, I snap it or I crack it or something. Dude, where is this other hole at? All right, there's that one. And there's that one, dude, finally. This isn't skate related, but how are you, bro? How's life going? Um, life's going pretty good, man, I'm pretty good. The YouTube channel's taking off. Like, YouTube now is like a, my official like job. Like, this is what I'm doing for money. This is what I'm doing to like survive and support myself, so. This has been a dream of mine literally since I started YouTube. One of my dreams was to just have YouTube be my job, and now it is, and I love it, dude. Makes me super happy. Favorite shoe? The Janowskis and the Shanes. As of right now, the Shanes are my number one because these are just like, like these are just holding up so well, it's ridiculous. Like I did not th think that these would last that long, but they are, dude, it's blowing my mind. All right, here comes the part of the setup that I hate, which is taking off and putting on the trucks. But I have this electric screwdriver, so this is about to make this like 50 times easier. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Dude, everything electric is, is just better. Electric screwdrivers, electric cars. Shout out to electricity. Oh, that's so satisfying, dude. I, I I used to always like just have a screwdriver and just like go like this for like the longest time. Favorite YouTube skater? Oh, dude, that's a really hard question because I watch like everyone. I watch Garrett, I watch John Hill, I watch Chris Chan. I think I like Chris Chan's style the most. Like Chris Chan does some insane fucking things. Um, but YouTube wise, probably John Hill or Brian Arnett. And I always say Brian Arnett's like one of my favorite YouTubers, not just cause he's the homie, um, but like his videos are just like really well put together. I really like the vibe of his videos. Dude, if you guys don't have a, an electric screwdriver to put together your boards, Highly recommend it. Was your parents overprotective where you went to skate? Where I went to skate or, or when I went to skate? Either way, um, dude, my mom has always been like so supportive of my skating. She understood like the skate life, you know? She understood that like skaters, you know, broke into school. Well, I shouldn't say broke in, but like she understood that like we would, you know, hop fences to like go skate in schools and stuff. Like she understood the skate life, which made her like even more supportive, which was really sick. And like she understood that like, Skaters also like stay out really late skating. Pretty sure as a parent, they would still be like, you know, worried and everything, but like, I don't know, with skating, it's it's just different. Like skaters don't do anything other than skate. Like we're not doing, I wanna say we're not doing anything bad, but like skating's kinda bad because like I just said, we have to like break into schools and like go skate and stuff. But no, I think if your parents like understand the skating lifestyle, they, I don't know, just if they're more understanding, I feel like it's a lot better. But yeah, my mom's always been supportive. All right, I don't know what just happened, but the GoPro just stopped filming. I think it overheated, I don't know. Um, I, I forgot what I was even talking about. Yeah, I'm sorry, I, I, dude, I forgot what I was talking about. The GoPro just fucked everything up. Can you tray revert? I actually don't think I've ever even tried that. I'm pretty sure I could do it. Maybe I'll do it after I set up this board, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, probably, I think I can. I think I can, I think I can. What age did you start skating? I was 12 when I started skating. I've always had a skateboard in the house though, ever since I was like a baby, but I never actually got into skating until I was like 12. Like that's when I actually started watching skate videos, like learning tricks is when I was 12. Okay, for whatever reason, the GoPro keeps stop, like it just keeps turning itself off. I think it's overheating, but I'm just gonna film with this for the rest of the way. All I have to do now is just put on the trucks, which isn't that exciting anyway. So we're almost done anyways. Cats or dogs? 
Okay, first of all, I like both. I've had both for pets, and I'll say this. I know there's dog people, and I know there's cat people. I feel like I'm more of a cat person because cats are just like considered evil, and like I said, I'm in love with like evil things and just horror in general. And cats are usually put into that category, which is why people don't really like them. I'll say this, I think dogs are the better animal but I think cats are the better pet because when you get a cat, you kind of just get a cat and then forget you have a cat. Like you don't really have to, like the cat doesn't really need you. A dog needs you. Like you have to walk a dog, you have to give them baths, you have to like baby a dog, but a cat, you just get a cat, get a litter box and forget you even have a cat. So cats are just like so much easier to take care of and dogs are just like a lot more maintenance. But I love dogs and cats, like I'll have either as a pet. Are you trying to get sponsored now or eventually? Um, honestly, no. Like, when I very first started skating and, like, for years after that, I would always be like, I want to get sponsored, I want to get sponsored. But now, I'm just, like, having so much fun with, like, this YouTube thing and just doing everything on my own. I kind of, I just, right now, I don't want a sponsor. Or not that I don't want one, but I'm not looking for one, you know? If someone offered to sponsor me, I'd be like, okay, sure, sick, like, let's do it. Um, but as of right now, I'm just, I'm just not looking for one. But if one were to come, I'd be like, okay, cool. What is your favorite truck brand? Probably independent. I haven't skated a lot of trucks. I think I've only ever skated Independent and Thunders and maybe Royals, I think, back in the day. So I haven't even skated every truck, so I honestly don't know. But right now, um, these Independents are really sick. I'm probably gonna get these again after this too. Are you ever going to collab with Brian Arnett? Yes, me and Brian still um, talk all the time. Not all the time, but we talk from time to time. And um, he's always like, Whenever you're in LA, like hit me up. And I'm like, if, okay, cool. If you're ever in Vegas, hit me up. Um, and I actually plan on going to LA next month around Halloween. I'll probably, I might actually be in LA on Halloween for like a few days. So while I'm out there, I'll definitely hit up Brian and see if he's free. Because I know a lot of my viewers are actually viewers of Brian too, so. Pretty sure you guys would love to see us in the same video. Like when I watch my favorite YouTubers, I'm always like, dude, it would be so sick to see like this YouTuber and this YouTuber in the same video. So yes, I will collab with Brian. I'm not saying it's gonna be when I go to LA, but it might happen, I don't know. Will I ever collab with Brian? Yes, and hopefully sometime soon. Dude, my phone is overheating too. It's not even that hot today. What's, what's the weather right now? I mean, it's 90 right now, but that's a lot cooler than most days here in Vegas. Dude, I literally have to take my phone out of the... Dude, my phone is so hot, I can't even touch it right now. This camera's probably gonna start overheating too. Um, but I have one more truck to put on and that's it. I'm done with the setup. I'm just gonna put this truck on and then um, I'll see you guys after that. Actually, you know what? Let's time lapse it. Okay, and there we go. Dude, this board is so sick. I feel like the paint on here is like really glossy or I'm just trip or I'm just like super used to like this metallic looking thing that like normal boards just look super sick now but yeah this looks really good. All right let's test out the uh, shape and everything. So far so good man. This thing feels feels pretty good. You know what though I kind of feel like I kind of feel like I put my trucks on the wrong way. Like I feel like this is the back truck and that's the front truck. It feels super... Dude, what? Yeah, it definitely feels like I put my trucks on the wrong way. Whatever, I'll fix it later. But yeah, man, that's the board. Dude, I'm kind of like obsessed with how it looked. You know what I just realized? I'm gonna be so mad if I if the GoPro didn't save any of the footage because it just stopped recording on its own. I don't know why. It did it twice. Got the Death Wish board, you know what I'm saying? Gonna keep this one as like a, a backup. Look, it didn't crack anywhere on the bottom of the board, it's just on the top. So I might be able to get some life out of this if I like, like if this one snaps completely, um, hopefully this one I can like get a few days of skating out of this board again. So yeah, I'm probably gonna keep this one. But just look at how well this board held up, dude. I've had it for quite a while, held up super good. Oh, I was so in love with this board, man. I think I'm really gonna like this one too though, so I'm happy. Like I said though, I, I can't answer every single question that I got, so um, I'll do another Q&A soon, hopefully. Um, I said in the last one I was gonna do one a month, and I don't think I have did one since then, so kind of slacking on the, I don't even know, if, like do you guys want Q&A videos like once a month or once every couple of weeks or whatever? Um, because I'm getting so many new subscribers, a lot of you guys have questions and I'm pretty sure you guys want them answered, so let me know if you guys even want like multiple Q&A videos. Oh, let me show you guys my shirt like I was talking about earlier. See that, can you guys see that? Hopefully, can, wait, can you guys see that? I don't know, hopefully you can. Every time I wear this shirt somewhere, like I can just feel people behind me just staring at it. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to sand down the board a little bit. 
It feels super good. Like the shape is really good. Size is super good. And it just looks good. Except I really think I put the trucks on the wrong way. So I'm going to switch that later on. Other than that though, dude, I love it. Anyway though, you guys, um, that's the board. That's the setup video. Hopefully this freaking GoPro saved the footage. You know what? Before I end this video, I'm going to check to make sure it did. Okay, it did. I'm happy. Oh, you know what? I didn't even do the kickflip test. I kind of want to film that with the GoPro, but the GoPro's fucking up. Oh, and my trucks are the wrong way. I'm pretty sure of it. So I'm probably going to have to kickflip on this backwards. All right, I got to skate it backwards for right now, but... Okay, yeah, that's super uncomfortable. Like, I, I got to switch my trucks. Oh, I got the kickflip, though. All right, yeah, it's super hot. Um, I got to go cool down my GoPro cool down my phone because my phone is like insanely hot um but yeah i'm gonna end the video there guys thank you guys for telling me to get a death wish board because like i said i never had one so far i like it it feels really good super comfortable but anyway though guys i'm gonna end the video if you guys liked it leave a like subscribe if you're new um by the time i post this i'm probably somewhere close to 50,000. i don't know i'm not too sure but subscribe if you're new and um i will see you guys in my next video peace <laughs>